Hi there buds, today we're gonna talk about torches. If you've been following my channel for a while, you're probably wondering, why is he going to legitimately do a review of his torch? Like he's had this on his channel since the beginning, like what must be so special about a torch that it actually needs a dedicated YouTube review? Well, let me tell you guys, I bought my very first torch from eBay and it was super cheap. Like it had to have been under $15. This video is going to be half a PSA, half review. So this was the little cheap torch that I bought. Looks like a normal torch. Um, let me just tell you guys, um, these cheap torches that are sold online may or may not be safe. Let me show you guys what happens to my torch. And I actually did use this torch for a little while. It's just kind of like a, like a flaw with this torch, but look at this. Now, I was a new dabber, wasn't familiar with torches. Think about this, I probably could have burned down my house. You guys, like it's a fucking flamethrower. No fucking lie, this thing is shooting flames. Yeah, <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, this was my very first torch. This is exactly why I thought I needed to do a review on torches because you guys do not go buy cheap torches online. They may or may not be safe. This one definitely is not safe. Like, what? <laughs> and if you notice, most dabbers use the same exact torch. And it is this one right here. It is the Blazer GT8000. Mine is covered with stickers from all of my little cannabis friends and businesses that have crossed my path. But uh, yeah, this is the Blazer GT8000. It is Dabber's number one choice for torches. This video also is not sponsored in any way by Blazer. Like not at all, but Blazer, if you see this video, come over here. <laughs> And upon looking at it, it just looks like any old torch. There's nothing really special about it. The first thing that you'll notice though is this is big. Like it actually holds a decent amount of butane, which is important for dabbers because you'll go through it like crazy and you don't want to have to refill your torch all the effing time. That is one thing that is great about the GT8000 is that it has a large tank in it. The second thing that you'll notice about the Blazer GT8000 is that it has a button um, ignition, which I really, really like. That's unlike some of the other um, torches out there. A lot of them have like triggers, kind of like the one that I showed earlier that was dangerous. I love that this one has a button. It's so much closer to the nozzle and it's just really easy to use. Now what sets the GT8000 apart from a lot of other torches is the pressure at which it shoots the butane. That is what makes it heat your banger up hot fast like this torch i noticed a huge difference in the time that it took for me to heat my quartz red hot when i upgraded to the gt8000 from just a regular old torch and honestly you can even see it like it's a blue flame it's a strong blue flame that's what you want out of your torch when you're looking for a torch for dabbing the flame needs to be super strong like you need a torch that's going to have a lot of pressure in it and that is going to shoot that butane at force because that is what's going to heat your banger up faster and i haven't seen another torch out there that has done a better job for dabbing than the gt8000 and i think that there's a reason why all dabbers use this torch and it's because it's honestly the best i have had this one for about a year and a half now two years now and i've had zero problems with it most people buy one blazer gt8000 in their life and it's probably gonna outlast them so it is worth spending the extra money on these do run i think 55 dollars on amazon i will leave a link in the description of this video if you do click the link i do get a percentage of the sales from amazon so click the link if you decide to buy the only thing that i don't like about the gt8000 is that this nozzle gets hot after using it which i dislike a lot um, because i have accidentally burned myself on it one or two times they do now make these like silicone nozzle guards that go over the nozzle i would love to have one of those because uh i think that that would be really useful for this i also love that unlike a lot of other 
torches it has like a stand on it so that it will stand up sturdy on your desk and it's not gonna like knock over or anything but yeah that's the blazer GT 8000 <laughs> it's basically the torch that you're going to see most experienced stabbers using if you like this video and it helped you give it a thumbs up let me know what type of torch you use in the comments below or if you've had a really scary torch like the one that I showed earlier thanks for watching and I'll see you guys around for whatever stony activity or video I come up with for next time bye guys